And we're back with the K1 World Grand Prix 2020 Japan Fukuoka at the Fukuoka International Center. We've got our main event, the K1 Cruiserweight title match here between these two monsters in the red corner, Sheena Karimian taking on in the blue, KG. I'm Brian. And I'm Ross. Let's break this down. So Sinner's got the height advantage of 15 centimeters. He's 200 centimeters tall. That's a big boy. He's a big, big boy. And uh, KG's got the youthful card, three years younger at 29. Yes, explosive and powerful. I know from personal experience, uh, KG hits hard. So this is an interesting matchup. KG is getting after it just like he needs to, man. Yep. It's actually a rematch as well. Absolutely, they fought back two years ago in a semi. And I do believe Sinner got the decision in that yeah. fight. So this is uh, unfinished business for KG. Yes. Ooh, you know? the, uh, and he's in his uh, in front of his hometown crowd here as well. Repeat or revenge. How many times have you seen this? Yes. Well, Sinner's not really using that height or reach very well at this point. He's letting KG get in close and work. Ooh. I don't think that's a good strategy in close. Yeah, no, he's got to watch out. Um, KG is just really explosive. He's definitely his most deadly right here in the beginning. Look oh. at this. He's just feeling shot. He's not moving. What the, What is going Ooh. on here? Move. Get your guard up. Move. Evolve away. Get the distance. Get the range. He's not even firing back. Oh, uh, yeah. When, uh, he's nodding, but we know what that means. Yeah, he's I know. Nodding. Exactly. He looks buzzed. Yeah, he's buzzed. Ooh. No one... No one takes three shots like that without being both. Doesn't matter if you nod or not. Oh yeah. His corner's got to be going crazy right He's now. He's got to get that guard up. Oh! oh we knew it was oh. coming. We knew it was coming. A oh, right, right over the top. Bang. Is he still going to try and convince himself that that doesn't mean anything? Oh. Come on now. Get on your toes. Get on your feet. Yeah, that was a massive right hand there from KG. And he is just going to throw everything at him right now to finish this thing off. Sheena's got to just try to survive. Yeah, he's got to he's got to get the oh. range. He's just got to go in survival mode yeah, and move he's away. Hurt. He's just teeing off the rest of Good decision. Wow. Good decision. Yeah, good stoppage. Massive moment for KG here. Um, Winning the tournament and crushed for their first Cruiserweight title and now becoming the Cruiserweight champion here in K1 and you know no less in front of his hometown crowd. He has worked really hard to get to this point. Hometown crowd, emphatic style. I mean he's ticked all the boxes for, uh, for the exact night that he wanted. Yeah. Gotta be. He's gonna be living on this one for years. Holy cow, what a moment, man. Um, yeah, interesting story with KG2 moving up from initially fighting at 70 kilograms. 70 kilograms, yep. got 20 kilos, wow. Making, he's gone up slowly over time, and uh, he's fought in the heavyweight division as well. Cruiser weights his home, and uh, yeah, just getting a massive victory. This is Sinner's face. He actually doesn't remember what's happening. He's now just being told. He thought he was still in the, uh, the changing rooms. Yeah, yeah, no, I'm sure the whole the whole experience here has been wiped um, from the hard drive. <laughs> Factory reset. Well, he got hit so many times, he must have thought he was surrounded. I mean, and he didn't move or use any of that ritual. Well, and yeah, and this is the thing. This is where KG is the most dangerous um, at these you know, opening moments in that first round. He's so explosive, and yeah, that fast twitch muscle fiber, and uh, he came out and got on it just exactly like he needed to. Yeah, it got to be an awesome feeling, and you know, to be doing it at the, you know, the first event in your home area, and he's just got to be elated. Unfinished business going in, he settled the score, and as you say, hometown, first round, just explosive fashion. I mean, he just blown Sinner away, and the crowd, to be honest with you, anyone watching that's going to be blown away. 
think we're, we're watching it just sink in right here, and it's just gotta be, um, yeah, just a huge mix of emotions, man, because he has really battled long and hard and had some extremely tough fights uh, to get to this moment, so it has to also just feel, uh, uh, you know, like, like a defining moment for him in his, uh, his kickboxing. Absolutely, I mean, it's gonna take a little while to download. But look at that face, look at it. You can see all the hard work and all the, all the tough rounds is all paid off. Yep, well, and to the champion goes the belt. He gets to strap on the hardware. Look at that sparkly, shiny thing right there. Look at that face. <laughs> He can't wait to get that around him. Many dream, very few actually get to wrap it up. The big shiny golden buckle there. And ladies and gentlemen, your new cruiserweight champion in K1, AG. Absolute monster. Absolute monster. Sinner's um, nickname was Hero. I think he needed one. I think he needed one because KG turned up with his kryptonite. Yeah, he, you know, he just did exactly what he needed to do and it worked, uh, it worked out perfectly for him. Yeah, there you go. Up oh, some more trophies. Are you kidding me? Heck yeah. yeah there's plenty of sparkling <laughs> things to take home now. Look at this. Yeah. Is there a medal involved as well? Oh, oh and a paycheck. Yes, please. Why not? KO Why bonus. Not? Don't mind if I do. Yep, take that too. Wow. Look at the punch variety. And the moment he got him hurt, he just shifted everything upstairs. Yeah. Sheena just didn't have any time to establish anything in that fight. Really odd. He, um... Oh, massive punches. Ooh, yeah, didn't, um, didn't get to use his range as distance. Normally, he's just like he's marching forward, uh, made from granite, impossible to hurt, but uh, not this evening. No, 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 no. He allowed himself to be uh, cornered and ropes, and, um, and his guard, it was, it was so low, and yeah. it was so open. Um, there was no head movement whatsoever. It was, it was no defensive instincts. He was completely caught cold. Right, and with the KO bonus on top of the brand new belt, top of the giant trophy, the accolades, the pictures. This is what happens, man. If you stick with it, you work hard. Yeah, the dreams do come true. They do, and he is uh, he has proven that one tonight in emphatic style. And uh, he hasn't got enough hands to carry all these sparkly stuff and big paychecks home. You know, um, he's going to need some help. Big time, big time. Can you have a golf cart? <laughs> One of those SUVs with great big boot. Well, maybe we'll get a little mic performance here to hear from the man himself. Um, yeah. What does it feel like? What, what, you know, I'm curious what's going on inside of that dome piece. Kei-Jitsu 今日は今日文化の日で本当え、九州の選手が九州で格闘技を盛り上げてくれて、え、今日盛り上がったと思うし、来年も再来年ももう文化の日は、え、K1福岡で九州の格闘技祭りとして定着してきたら嬉しいと
今後どんどん九州でイベント開いてくれたら、えー、間違いなく九州からスターがいっぱい生まれると思います、えー、運営の皆さんとスポンサーの皆さんとどうぞよろしくお願いします、えー、今回一つチャンピオンになって一つの夢が実現できてこれから、えー K1 ではチャンピオンにあクルーザー級では一番になったけど K1 はいろんな階級があって試合自体はやっぱでかいし人間が見れて面白いと思うけど選手の層が厚いしまだまだレベルも低くて選手の人気もなくて、えー、軽量級の選手に負けてるんでこの階級は責任を持って俺を引っ張ってどの階級よりも面白い。えー、その熱い階級にしていきたいと思います皆さんよろしくお願いしますありがとうございました刑事選手本当におめでとうございます Well there you go He may not be a natural blonde But he's a natural on the mic And he's now the champ Yeah it's some interesting words there You know he wants to The, the cruiserweight division is relatively new In K1 And he realizes the um, other divisions Have been around longer The fighters there are just really skilled and talented in the cruiserweight division and he's holding himself up to that level so he's going to take on that responsibility and I don't think there's anyone better to do it uh, than the man himself. Absolutely, he's clearly the man for the job. His explosive style, I mean, it lends itself to highlight rules. Yes. You know, you are absolutely right. Well, and there you have it. The K1 World Grand Prix 2020 Japan Fukuoka at the Fukuoka International Center. We will see you next time. <laughs>